Good morning. It's Sunday and this is breakfast. I made an, um, a breakfast sandwich. So I did an Aunt Millie's sourdough English muffin for three points. Then there is, I mean, far less than anything that would cause a point for the um, fit and active egg substitute. I just used what was ever left in the whatever was left in the carton, and it didn't even fill like the whole base, so it's for sure not a point. Um, there are two slices of the kind of messed up. Two slices of the Hillshire Farm ham for one point, and then a slice of the Velveeta cheese for one point. So this total three, four, five points for this sandwich. And then my coffee, my normal Sunday mug with a caramel vanilla cream K cup. I brewed it and then I put it in the fridge for about an hour and made it colder. Then I put in two, no, well, three tablespoons, three tablespoons of the Nestle sugar-free French vanilla or coffee make for one point. And then I put in, sorry, I figured I would show you all my ingredients. Oops. A third of a cup of the Trader Joe's unsweetened vanilla almond milk for zero. And then I put in three teaspoons of this Da Vinci sugar free white chocolate. I found this at Home Goods. Oh my gosh. Oh, I paid some money for it. It was $5.99, but whatever. It's because it's glass. Um, I was just like moving bottles around to try and find something and I happened upon this and I absolutely put it in my cart immediately. Then I put in two teaspoons of the Jordan Skinny Syrups sugar-free mocha to try and make like a white chocolate mocha-y flavor. This was also, well, TJ Maxx Home Goods. They're combined in my town or where I go, so that's why they have TJ Maxx labels on there. But um, those are zero points. I also put some of the Jordan Skinny Syrups whipped foam topping in marshmallow on there for zero points. I also got that at Home Goods. So anyway, this is five points. That is one point. And I'm also going to have a banana. And then this little baby is waiting for mommy to have a banana so she can have some. Right? Right? All right, I'll see you later. Hello, friendles. I am on my way to go grocery shopping to Walmart, Aldi, and maybe the Dollar Tree. Um, I brought my coffee with me, but I had to trans transfer it into a cup that would fit in my car. Hey, y'all. Mm, it's really good. I'm so glad I found that white chocolate syrup. Woo! Yay. Oh my gosh. Yes, I'm doubled up. Sunday is usually glasses day. So, oh, uh, it's bright outside. Oh man, oh man. Um. So, I'm feeling like so cute right now, okay? I'm, I'm just wearing black. Oh, I didn't notice they have like an Aztec print on them. You can barely tell. I'm wearing black workout capris, a white tank top that's like flowy sort of, and then this little jacket thing. And my sneakers. I very rarely wear sneakers outside the house other than to walk. <laughs> so, but I just feel so cute today. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um, so, we're going shopping. I think I've decided this week I'm going to make nachos, um, mm. nachos, some sort of burger, either a Boca burger or the black bean burgers from Aldi. I saw on Jay Wacker's grocery haul that she got them and I talked to her and she said they were really good. So either those or a Boca burger. Um, there was this guy in our meeting that was talking about how he put Boca burgers on like sandwich thins and put a cheese wedge. I told you yesterday about this and he really likes those. So I might try to do that because I can always make them with like fries on the side and a vegetable or something. <laughs> um, what else I going to do? Nachos. 
burgers of some sort. Um, oh, barbecue. I'm going to get the Lloyd's barbecue again. I haven't had that in a really long time. Shrimp fried rice, guac tatoes, and that's it. But I'll probably have nachos twice. And then for lunch, I think I'll do, I have a mac and cheese from Trader Joe's, so I'll put some tuna in there probably. And then, um, ham and cheese pitas, like I was doing the other week. And then maybe next week I'll start up taco soup again. And for snacks, grapes and carrots with my ranch dressing. I need to make my ranch dressing today. Oh, I'm also going to make salsa. So I'm going to get stuff for salsa and make that to have. It'll be so delicious. Um, I'm trying to use Ibotta more. If you have not used Ibotta, it is, and I use Walmart savings catcher. I use Ibotta, um, and I use cartwheel. So Ibotta is an app where you go shopping and you buy things and you go on Ibotta to see if you can get cash back for that stuff. So like, for example, they have all these different grocery stores. So you can go to Walmart if you went to Walmart and they have like a, a deal where you can get 25 cents back if you bought bananas or like a dollar if you bought some crazy item or whatever. Um, so you just search through and find all the items that you purchased and then you scan your receipt and sometimes scan the items and then it gets you cash back for those things. And once you hit like a $20 minimum, you can transfer it to your PayPal and it's cash. So yes, um, I would definitely recommend that. I think I have a link for it, so I'll put it in the description box if you have not tried out Ibotta yet. Um, I also use, what's it called? Shopkick. Shopkick used to be really good where you could you could scan a whole bunch of stuff and you, like it's awesome. It's like a scavenger hunt in the store. So it gives you if you walk into Target, you get a certain number of points or kicks for walking into Target, like 30 points. And that's put into your account. And then they give you a list of things to find and scan and you get points every time you scan an item. So like maybe bounty paper towels was 20 points and then Hillshire Farm Ham was 15 points or whatever. And then you just go through and scan all those items and it all racks up into your account. And once you hit a certain, you know, amount, you can trade it in for a gift card. So like you can get a Target gift card for like $10 um, using 2000 points or whatever it is. But it's so awesome. I love Shopkick. I just haven't used it in a while because they were getting kind of stingy with the things that you could scan and get points for. So I haven't checked it out recently, but I might when I'm in Walmart because I have some time. So yeah, I think I have a link for Shopkick, so I will put it down below if I can find it. <sighs> so those are my little saving tips for the day. <laughs> I need like theme music. Um, oh, what if I am stepwise? It's 1240 and I have 1400 steps, 1442. So Marley and I will definitely take a walk later, a long walk later. I think I get like almost 4,000 steps with that walk because it's a two mile walk. I think that's what I calculated yesterday. Um, yeah, cause I left the house at 4838 in steps. And when I got back, I had already hit my 8,000. So just under maybe 4,000 steps, but that's cool. I'll take it. And it's so nice now with the weather cooling down. It's, um, it says it's 74 out, but it's really breezy, beautiful. <laughs> to work today. Uh, uh, I really have to be more fo focused during the week in order to not have to work over the weekend. But there was a lot. There was a lot to do this week. Like over a hundred. I don't know. That's a lot. Trust me. Um, and I'm going to start mentoring somebody new soon, but not immediately. Guys, I have been, okay, so I got another sticker order in yesterday, but I had ordered back, I think Labor Day is when I ordered it, so it just came in. 
Um, and I'm waiting on one more from that original order a thon. And I'm gonna do my thing. I haven't decorated my planner yet, so I gotta do that. Um, so yeah, I want to, I want to film a sticker haul, but I did place like, <laughs> I think I placed another order yesterday because this shop, Inspirational Junkies, had the, I mean, don't have any words for it, Christmas spreads up yesterday. They were so cute. They had Scotty's and plaid and I'm not quite sure how I'm supposed to not buy that because that's like mm. oh my gosh I'm so excited about them but I hope they don't take forever to get here that's the one I ordered from that shop back on Labor Day and I'm still waiting for that order I think so and then I also order did I order from I don't know. I'll have to check. There were a bunch of shops like having deals like for whoever's birthday or I don't know, just like weekend stuff. So I kind of added a whole bunch of things to my cart and then I, whatever's the better deal I buy and then I'll ponder the other ones. But, um, all right. Well, I'm almost in town. I don't know what I'm going to do for lunch today. I had what? Six points for breakfast. I just want to keep eating out. Ooh. I kind of want like Taco Bell. I haven't had Taco Bell in a really long time. I have to sneeze. Um, but maybe not. I don't know. I might get Taco Bell. It might happen. Which is 15 points. Which would leave me, that would be 21 points. That would leave me 15 points left for dinner. Which, yeah, I could do that. Right? Yeah. I could do that. Totes, my goats. Okay. I will check in with you guys later. Look. Berry Hill Preserves. I love it. Hey guys, I know Jana showed this in her most recent video today. So these are at Walmart. They're basically the same as the Jordan Skinny Syrups ones that I can't find anymore. Um, so look at Walmart for them. Mine has French vanilla, caramel, hazelnut, and mocha right next to the Tarani syrups. Yes. All right, just wanted to show you. Hey, hey, hey. I had to ditch the jacket. It was too hot. Well, it's 74 apparently, but I just could not handle it. So I am almost home. Are you turning? I don't know. You're braking, but you're certainly not indicating that you're turning. <sighs> um... I do have a window down, so I hope you can hear me. I went to the Dollar Tree, mainly just to get shipping supplies. So I wanted to send out a couple things. So um, I got like little clasp envelopes and bubble wrap and a box and stuff like that. I did find some cute little denim stickers. So I only got two packages. I kept it real, you know, reined in. And then, <laughs> um, I got some batteries too, just cause why not? Um, what's going on? Uh. Then I went to Aldi. I got some good stuff, got some different stuff. So I'm excited about it. I'm going to film a grocery haul when I get home after I eat my lunch. I went to Walmart and got some more good stuff. And then I went to Taco Bell and I got a double decker taco for 10 points and a nacho cheese Doritos Locos taco for five points. The total is 15 points. I also got a medium diet Pepsi because it was a dollar and I donated a dollar to local schools for something, something, something. So they gave me a free, like a taco coupon. Cool. So that is the update, yo. You know what? Aldi is smart. Because they get me every time. I forget to bring my little reusable bags that I purchase every single time I go to Aldi. And then I have to buy a new one because I have nothing to carry it out with. Mm -mm -mm. 
so I bought another bag today. <laughs> oh, I probably have like four or five Aldi bags at this point. But yeah, bought another one. At least they're like not expensive. Right? <laughs> they sure do get me every time. Good job, Aldi. Do 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 do. It is two, well, it's almost three o'clock. I'm gonna eat lunch, film grocery haul, have to film my step into tracking update, <sighs> take Marley for a walk, and work. Yeah. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get a planner thing filmed today, I don't think. I'll probably have to do it tomorrow. I haven't even decorated it yet, so. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, um, I guess I can show you my tacos when I get home. <laughs> 15 points. But I will see you, whoa, later. Okay, these are my two tacos. Double decker, which is a soft taco, then refried beans, and then a crunchy taco with normal stuff on the inside. That's 10 points. Then the Doritos, Doritos nacho cheese one is five points. I'm gonna put some mild sauce on it. Have my little, oops, my little uh, drink with it. Little baby girls here. All right, see ya. Hi guys, we're walking. Yes, indeed, we're talking. You and me. We're just getting our steps in for step into tracking. Marley's getting hers in. I'm getting mine. I think I have 5,100 at this point. We're about halfway through our walk. Um, uh, so, um, are you allowed to drink beer and drive a golf cart at the same time? Somehow I feel like that's not right. <laughs> hey, come on, let's move along. Um, so, filmed my grocery haul. I'm gonna get that up for you. Once I get home, I need to film my step into tracking update, but hopefully by that point I'll have hit my steps for today, because that's the biggest thing is for me is getting the steps in, but I've done well so far this week and I've done it every day, so yay. <sighs> um, oh, more people are coming. <sighs> All right, I'll talk to you in a little bit. Guys, does this not look like a scene from like Lord of the Rings or I don't know, or <laughs> Game of Thrones? It just looks like so foresty. These little girls are walking and we're talking. <laughs> Okie dokie, I'm back. But I don't have much to tell you. Why is that? Why is there a random table in the forest? That's kind of weird. What is that? The heck is that? <laughs> anyway. Uh, I'm so excited about the stuff that I got, guys. Like, for food. I'm very excited. Although I ended up with, like, three different kinds of meats. I don't know how that happened. I got ground turkey, taco meat or beef, and then ground beef. So, I have a lot. Oh well, we'll just save it and use it later. Put it in the freezer, it'll be good to go. Hmm. What does that little crow have to say, man? Okay. I don't know what time Chad's getting home tonight, but hopefully we can watch, well, we have to watch, wait, is Big Brother on tonight? Well, if that's on, we have to watch that, but otherwise, we can watch Game of Thrones, yay! Oh, I want to watch it. Um, and I can decorate my planner and work, still have to do that, I haven't done any of that yet, and I've got quite a bit left. Marley. Um, I have to say, I feel like my black shoes are what makes me feel so cool. 
because I just, can you see them? Yeah, I just love them. I don't know why, but every time I put them on, I'm like, yeah, fancy. <laughs> I don't know. I will confess that I've had two pieces of candy corn. However, I had one at like 11.30, which is zero. And then I had one at like 3.30, which is zero. Because I think if you eat them separate, then it still, it counts as like, you know, if you were to eat it once. Get what I'm saying? Anyway, <laughs> I did have two pieces of candy corn, but that's it. I didn't have more. <sighs> We're stopping. All right, guys. Well, I don't. I don't want to keep you on here because I don't want to make the video long for no reason. So I will probably check in later with dinner. I'm not sure what I'm making yet tonight. Um, I'm kind of feeling like that hamburger bun, a hamburger bun, which I found some for three points, or and like the barbecue. Mmm. Yeah. And I need to make my ranch dressing. I need to make salsa. I want to make those little muffins with the cake and the Greek yogurt. Oh, dang it. A lot to do. All right. See you later. All right. This is dinner. I have the Farm Ranch Smokehouse Pulled Pork Barbecue. Um, that is a third of a cup for four points. This, the hamburger bun, is from Aldi. And they are three smart points a piece. So this is seven points total. I'm so excited. And then this is the Market Pantry Shoestring Fries. 40 pieces is five points. So this total is 12 points for dinner. I will have a tablespoon of reduced sugar ketchup for zero. If I go any more than that, it would be one point. So 12 points. I'm gonna have this for two points. What do you think about that? It's me again, and it's late. It's midnight, so I'm gonna go to bed. Um, I did have, let's see. Oh. Before dinner, I did have one pretzel rod, so that was one point. Um, dinner was 12 points, and then I did have a Weight Watchers chocolate caramel bar for two points, which brought me to zero points for the day. I am pretty sure that's right. <laughs> I seem to be forgetting to track little things here and there, like my creamer or something, but I think I got it this time. Um, so I did 36 for 36 today, I'm pretty sure. And I got all my water in. I I am, oh, it's gonna be beyond midnight now, so my steps. Oh, 9,863. So, woot. I completed all of the first week of step into tracking, and I did it good. I think that's all I wanted this time. I'm so tired. So, I'm going to go to bed. I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's Monday. I'm not excited about it. Ugh, I worked from like, I got home maybe around 6.30. I worked from then until like 11. We've been watching Game of Thrones. I'm like, how do you stop watching? I just want to keep watching. I need to figure out what happens. I need to see what happens. <gasps> anyway, alright. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow must be productive. Fingers crossed. Have a good night. Bye.